Hey everyone. Um, so I'm here for Art Create, and um, Art Create is our take on Open Studio. And because we usually do this in the comfort of the co-create space at the Leesburg Center for the Arts, um, this is going to be a little different. So this is in the comfort of your home, comfort and safety in your home. Um, I wanted to do something. I, I want. I'm kind of going through a little bit of a tornado of ideas. So I wanted to do something that was more of an art assignment to get me, to give me the foundation I needed to create something. But then at the same time, I can embellish and um, add to that and, and adorn it in the way that I see fit. So I, I needed a base and then from the base, I could do whatever I wanted, right? So I stumbled on an article um, by, oh, by a wonderful young lady who her husband and herself host the art assignment on PBS. And um, she uh, wrote an article that talks about how you don't have to really wait for that creative muse the creativity muse to come and tap you on the shoulder and say, it's time, just do something. So, and it'll, it'll flow through you. And so she offered five suggestions, um, art assignments of doing this. And one, which is the one I'm working on, is called uh, Portrait Shadow. And this is, what you do is you take some wire hangers. So if you have some wire hangers laying around, uh, fortunately for me, I still have um, some from the dry cleaners. Um, and I, I grab those and you construct it. I don't know if you can see that very well, but you you take it all apart and then you form it to be a portrait of yourself. So I'm still working on mine, but this would be kind of some sort of like, it would be a draft version of a portrait of myself, right? And then you get like feathers. You kind of look around your house. You get feathers, beads. Um, whatever you want to adorn it to make it look more like you and then you take it and the idea is then you turn around and you take it once it's completed and put it against a light colored wall and take a picture of it it'll cast a shadow and it gives this really cool effect well that's all great right that's a really good foundation for me and i thought well heck i want to do that and i'm going but i want to add a little bit more so then i took uh, additional I took another wire hanger which is this one and took it and um, created just actually it broke in half by accident but I don't believe in wasting some of this stuff and I'm gonna make it into kind of like a 3d version I don't know if you can see that wait hold on maybe, maybe that way see that better and then um, so I'm gonna get my um, solder out and I'm gonna solder this together so that you'll see that in another video when it's done and then I'm gonna take and I've been working on kind of the different ensembles of beads put together so that it'll hang off of this with some leather straps and maybe some lace and muslin um, I'm not really quite sure what kind of materials I'm thinking lace but lace is lace is pretty but it doesn't really fit me so I'm gonna check it out I have a really cool plaid that I think I'm gonna use now that I think about it and then I have um, then it's going to actually stand so I'm working on how that's I got to figure out how that's gonna work and I think it's gonna be like this right and then it's gonna have a stand um, I have I had a really great opportunity to um, hang out with Vicki Murphy at Victoria's uh, warehouse before it closed and she has an extraordinary eye for antiquities and furniture and then morphing that into something that you will take home and it becomes a sculpture in your home, usable art in your home. So she was um, closing her shop and she had an abundance of um, table legs and <laughs> for whatever reason I bought all of these table legs and the I didn't have a purpose for them. I don't have a reason to buy them. I love architectural anything. So I was like, I need these. So now I have a purpose for at least one. I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna make it into the base. 
So then, then this becomes a really cool um, 3D sculpture that it's gonna hang, that's gonna be in my house, and I'm really looking forward to that. So stay tuned. Um, I'm going to uh, spend a little bit of time soldering some pieces together, and then stay with me for next week. And next week, we're, I'm gonna work on it again, and um, you'll get to see the. Um, the table leg I'm going to use and some of the other fabric pieces. So, okay, happy creating and I hope to see you for the next Art Create. Thank you. Bye.